I'm outside St. Rosa Lima Church where it is very clear that Officer Dennis Guerra and his family are loved. It was a sea of NYPD blue lining shorefront parkway as police officers in rows by the thousands paid their solemn respects to Officer Dennis Guerra, the first officer to die in the line of duty in more than two years. Officer Guerra died from injuries after racing to a fire in Coney Island last Sunday. His partner, Rosa Rodriguez, remains in critical but stable condition. Police say the fire was intentionally set by a teenager, Marcel Dockery, who told investigators he was bored. If convicted, he will face 25 to life. Officer Guerra's body passed through the streets of his Queens community, held by his own NYPD brothers. The funeral mass was presided by many, including Bishop Cipetto, the NYPD chaplains, Monsignor Romano and Monsignor Casado, and also Monsignor Splengler, the pastor of St. Rose of Lima. Mayor de Blasio spoke at the funeral and announced a posthumous promotion. Example of valor and devotion to duty that he set. And for that reason, the commissioner has chosen to posthumously promote to first grade detective Dennis Guerra. I spoke to many outside praising his actions and the man he was. He's a good man. Um, uh, usually we have a lunch together in uh, Far Rockway High School. So uh, I hope he's uh, going in the good, safe place. We all pray for him. Oh, Mr. Guerrero is a good man. Officer Guerra leaves behind a wife, four children, and a hero's legacy. We are family. We are family. We serve the same purpose, to defend the country, and that's what he was doing. The blaze has forced the police department to question their fire response policies. Before last week, there had been no mandatory fire protocols. For Currents, I'm Michelle Powers.